Parade Day, 2018. I stood up and my left leg was stuck to the floor. Like it literally, I couldn't move it. So I lifted it up and I fell. And the next thing I knew, within an hour, I was in the hospital. I'm 35 now, but yeah, I was 33. I don't remember the stroke or cardiac arrest, but I know I, I was at a party with my friends. After that, I just remembered having some chest pain, shortness of breath, and I went, went outside and I don't rem remember after that. With EMS, they were talking to the hospital the whole time. Her blood pressure is this, her heart rate is this. We've done this so far and um, well, first of all, they determined I was having an acute ischemic stroke, and that is the most, one of the most deadliest strokes. I think I was fortunate to have Dr. Goyle because he was one of the first uh, neurologists to do that process. What they do is they um, go in through your uh, groin and go up through your heart and then, and they've done that process before, but then they are going right into your brain to pull the clot out. I was actually surprised when I went to the stroke unit. There's four beds in my room and four beds in the other room and I was the only person who could walk. And just knowing I could walk gave me so much more confidence that I was going to get better. So that's how, how lucky I was that they were able to grab that clot. I was here for 222 days. I lost my vision. I lost a lot of short-term memory. I didn't remember my anniversary. I didn't remember my, my, some of my friends' birthdays. Like, I lost most of my memories. I'm amazed by the um, amount of support I've gotten over the last year. I have a therapist coming to my house once a week to help me gain my independence independence back and it's amazing how much I improved like every time I see a doctor they can't believe how much how much my speech is improving the Hotchkiss Brain Institute they are inviting applications internationally to join the fellowship program which can be two years or three years and so many of the people stay and continue to work at the foothills and work in neurology. I think the message is know that the Institute is here to help you. Look at what they did for me and look at what they did for my son. It's so important and it can save so many lives. I stayed here for eight months, and so I just wanna do anything I can to help the Hotchkiss 